Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Sorry for the weird lighting. This camera is different than my other ones. But today I'm here with, of course, my husband Stephen and my beautiful daughter Brinley that you guys all know. She is back there. Oh, you can't see her. But she's back there sleeping away. But today we are going to have a fun-filled day, pretty much. Um, we are going to Orlando with our friends Matt and Betsy, her godparents. We're gonna go to Disney Springs, which is like also known as Downtown Disney, or used to be known as Downtown Disney. And we're just gonna like have a good time. Um, it's really cold, so the weather's keeping up. It's like what, like 60s? It's, it's cold for our state. Okay, it's cold for Florida. It's like 50s, 60s. For some of you guys, that's summer, but for us, it's winter. So we're excited about that, but we are on our way to Matt Betsy's, and then we're gonna hop in their car and then go to Orlando. So I'm so excited. Um, Brindley's been to somewhere near Orlando, but she hasn't been in Orlando, so that's exciting. Tell them about your view. So I got a haircut last night, and then usually Erica shaves everything off, but like this time, I asked her to keep everything on and just kind of line it, so I have a little beard now for a no-shave November. He's so proud of it. I, I wasn't a fan, but it's growing on me, but he is like so happy to have his beard because I usually tell him to take it off, so. He's a happy boy today. Okay guys, so I'm here with Betsy. Hello. And you know what? I think I'm gonna put a flashback of when me and you went to Disney Springs. When we said literally 50 million times. Yes, that one? yes. <laughs> we, I remember like, I think when they renovated, it was the first time I went with you. Yes. And it was really, really cool. Yes. But um, I'm here with her now. We stopped at Starbucks. Brinley is there sleeping away, so she's being a good girl. There's the lumberjack in the front. <laughs> My lumberjack And then husband. Steven right there, yes. Oh, she just got married, which I've, I've talked Finally. about it. So she's a married woman now, but we are almost, well not almost there, we're like an hour and a half away. Yeah. And I'll catch you when we get there. Okay guys, so we're in the parking garage now, but we just made it to Disney Springs. It is actually Brinley's first time being in the toddler seat of the other baby and I have to show you because she looks so cute. Look at her. Hi baby. Are you so cozy? Oh my gosh, she looks so cute. Steven, look. She's never been in this. Because we figured she's going to be um, in the stroller for so long, so this would be more comfortable than her infant car seat. How do you like it? And she's nice and cozy. How do you like it? Oh, you love it? You're so cute. Nothing. What are we going to do now? Probably shop. We're going to shop some. So far, Brinley is loving the stroller because she's keep smiling. Yeah. And she sees everything, too. Look at her. Can you smile for the camera? She literally keeps smiling, and of course when I put it on her, she doesn't. Rainy! Oh, now she now she's getting fussy. <laughs> but she was, and I think it's nicer because she can like see everything. But we're here now, and it's not too busy, so we're enjoying it. So first stop is food because we were getting pretty hungry, especially this one over here. He wouldn't shut up about it. Yeah, he's very accurate. What'd you get? And so we're at like a little Mexican place and Brinley ended What'd up falling asleep. Get? She's been really good with her schedule today. She's sleeping away. This thing is so nice. We're waiting for our food now and then I'm going to show you what we get at the end. We just got our food and Steven said he wasn't hungry and then he's eating my whole entire bowl. I've taken one bite. No, you could devour that. Use the lime. I'm okay. But here it is. It's like a little burrito bowl or whatever. So we're gonna eat this and then shop, right, Steven? Go spend all my money. Hell yeah. <laughs> we were just at um, Anthropology and apparent I was reading like the signs and let me know if you're into the um what are they called? Uh, the Zodiac signs. Zodiac, Zodiac signs. signs. Yeah. Let me know if you guys are in it because I feel like a lot of them are accurate. But we are here in my favorite store, Zara, and I am so excited because they have the best kids section. So let's look at it. Betsy shopping away. Yes. And I need some new jeans. But I don't know what size I am because I literally never wear jeans. Oh my god. You're you're so you never wear never. jeans. Like literally, I'm either yeah. work pants or like this. That's very true. Matt, Matt's got a workout for real. <laughs> Matt, what do you want Betsy to be in? This. Oh, scandalous. But, but like I love like that, that he thinks that like that's my style. Like, <laughs> I don't think he cares about the style. I think he cares how much you show. No, literally he'll be like, don't wear leggings, wear something sexy. Of course. <laughs> Brinley is up, she's up hanging out, but Brinley, let's go see what's upstairs. Is that okay? Huh? Let's go. We have to look at the elevator, Steven, to go upstairs. I don't think it's the right Okay, let's look. Come on, eat. let me go in there with you. Jesus. <laughs> 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 Good one. 
Give it. Yeah, I know. All right, we're in Zara, and the girls are going crazy. Matt's picking his nose. Yeah, you are. No lie. Trying to find a bathroom. Yeah. What you trying? What you trying to find over there? A bathroom. Why? I gotta go. You gotta go what? Two. Number two. Right. And she's being the best baby. Mama, what are you doing over there? What? Oh my god, guys. I'm in my element. Look how cute these are. Ah, okay. These are so freaking cute. And then, look at this. Oh, by the way, we may be going somewhere. <laughs> Steve and I may have booked a trip. Comment down below where you think we're going, but it's going to be cold. And so we have to get her cold stuff. And so I'm so excited, and this is so freaking cute, and I cannot wait. I'm so sad because this Zara is really far from my house, so obviously it's like two hours. It's really dark because we're in an elevator. Oh gosh. So we're sad because we're leaving, but we got good stuff, and I will show you guys what we got when we got home, or when we get home. We're leaving Zara. Missy's being a good girl. You are. She is being such a good baby, and I love her, but I have to feed her soon, so we gotta eat soon, baby. So we're currently in a bathroom because this Brittany over here decided to poop through all her clothes. He's so crazy or what? Yeah, if somebody thinks it's funny. Thank God I got her another outfit because I really have to redo everything. Like I have to take everything off of her. So, but it's okay because she's a baby and she does need to jump. Yeah. And then Matt and Betsy, I think, went to go. Matt wants to go buy some underwear or something like that. So we'll meet up with Matt after, and then I think after that, uh, we'll walk around a little bit, we'll dinner or something. We may have. Oh, it's three o'clock. We may have like an early dinner and go from there. Okay, guys, we are now at the Disney store, and I feel all the Christmas feels in here. Yes, it's very nice. And it is so cold. Like it's what, it's like 50 degrees. Yeah. It's 50 degrees. What are you doing over there? Yeah, but he's up to something. <laughs> What are you no. doing? No, media. this guy. So media. he's like over two today with his Starbucks drink. He got oh one God. this morning. Tastes like trash. And they messed up his order again. That's two times. <laughs> Starbucks. That's what you get for being high maintenance. <laughs> um, but look at this Disney store. It's huge. Look at it. It's it looks like Christmas. And there's like three different entrances. It is so nice. And Brinley is taking a nap again because she's a sweet little girl. So our day at Disney Springs has ended. It's probably like 50 degrees. It's super, super cold. Brinley yeah. is still awake. I don't know what Matt's doing. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, no, I don't care. And um, she's been taking her bottle, which is really nice because we can like walk and feed at the same time. Mm -hmm. I think we're going to leave now and we're going to go get some dinner. The boys want to go to Longhorn. No. But that's probably where we're going to end up because they had to sit through our shopping. So oh, yeah. compromise, oh, right? Are you being a good girl? Yeah. She's having such a good hair day because it's so cold out that she, it's like flat. You good girl? Yeah. She's literally the best baby ever. We are both literally so hungry. Yeah. I don't. I feel like our lunch wasn't even big either. No. It was. Mine was like a tiny and, cider. Right? Oh, dude, hers was like. Okay, you know like the queso that you get at Tijuana Flat? Like that's the size of the cup <laughs> that she had. It didn't even finish it. And the worst is it was six bucks. Like, yeah, six dollars for like two right. spoonfuls. Oh, and... Steve Fisher had oh, sorry, oh, Brittany. No. She lost her pacifier. And... And on, <laughs> and on top of it, none of us had breakfast either. Yeah. I am literally so hungry, so I'm so excited Actually, to eat. Actually, lie. What? I made what you always do. What? Well, you do like a piece of toast with the egg, with the seasoning, it was so good. Wasn't it so good? Except I had cheese on mine because I can have oh, cheese. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But it was so good. Okay, guys, that, that toast that I always tell you about with like the egg and the toast and the everything but the bagel seasoning from Trader Joe's, you need to try it because not only do I think it's good, she tried it and she says it's really good. A plus. So definitely try it if you're looking for a quick, easy, and healthy breakfast. But hopefully, I mean, we're like 45 minutes away from the restaurant, but hopefully we get there soon because mama's hungry. Mama's got to eat. Mama's got to eat. The lighting here is really dark, so I'm not sure if you can see me, but we are here now at Longhouse. Longhouse? Longhorn. I'm so hungry, I'm delusional. But um, we just ordered. Brinley is enjoying some um, godmother time. She is eating her hands, and she's a happy camper over there because she's finally out of the car seat. Matt's being a little wiener. <laughs> 
and Steven is just being Steven. I will um, get back to you guys. Uh, yeah, she's, oh my gosh, it's so, she's like eating it up. Rinley's eating um, Betsy's finger. But anyways, once we get our food, I'll show you what we get. So it is a couple days, well, actually it's not a couple days later, it's the next day. Don't mind me, I literally just got freshly out of the shower while Brindley was is napping and I feel like a new woman. I completely forgot to show you guys what we ordered. I don't know if some people care, but I was so starving, I scarfed it down, but it was just I got like chicken breast veggies and mashed potatoes and Steven got steak and salad. It was delicious. Our tummies got full. But I said I was going to show you guys what I got at Zara. I didn't get a lot. I got three things for my sister's daughter for part of her Christmas present. But I'm not going to show it on the vlog because I think she, I'm pretty positive she watches my vlogs. And I don't want her to know. It's a surprise for her too. I'm going to show you what I got Brindley instead. So, we haven't mentioned it in the vlog. I think I mentioned it in this vlog earlier, but Steven and I decided to book a trip because Steven and I have always really enjoyed traveling and we have been to many places together from the time that we were dating to engaged, married, and all that. But once we got married, we said we wanted to take um, an international trip and a state in-state trip each year. Last year, um, I don't believe we took an in-state trip. I mean, we did little staycations, but we obviously went to Paris and we went to London, we went to St. Lucia. We also went on our baby moon. And then this year, it was just a really crazy year. Obviously, I was pregnant most of the year, so there's not as much exciting things that you can do internationally. We were gonna go to Iceland, but I couldn't get in like the Blue Lagoon or the Hot Lagoon or do much because I was pregnant. So we didn't get a chance to go somewhere internationally, but we decided, you know what, no, like, we just love traveling, so we squeezed one trip in before the year ended. Since we're going somewhere, we're going very somewhere very cold, and so I got Brinley a little snow jacket, and it is so adorable. It is like this like blush color, and it has like a little high collar, and then inside it's fleece. So I'm gonna leave this linked down below if you guys need this for your babies. So cute, and it's so little, and I actually put her in it, and she looks so tiny in it, and it was adorable. Also from Zara, I got her the cutest little top. It's like a burgundy color and it has like little embroidered whatever flowers and then a little frayed top and the sleeves are frayed and then it has three buttons in the back and I'm actually gonna go online and order this in all the colors that this comes in because they only had this color and I saw online they have it in like a blush pink and like a burnt orange so I'm gonna do that. And then the last thing from Zara that I got were these adorable little leggings. They are so cute. They're super thick and they're ribbed and it's like a blush material and then it has like a little tutu thing here and the wooden little button. So those are the three things that I got from Zara. I'll try to leave those things linked down below. At Baby Gap, I got her this adorable onesie like... She's taking her nap. Steven just got here. I love you. Love you. Are you gonna know what you got? Yeah, I got this adorable <laughs> little onesie and it's like an oatmeal color and it has a little collar. It is so freaking cute. So those are the things that I got for Brindley. Um, slowly and surely I'm like getting her little winter um, wardrobe situated because she doesn't have a lot of winter clothes. But that is pretty much it for this vlog. This vlog is probably all over the place. And I feel like we didn't vlog like a lot at um, Disney Springs. We had so much fun there and we were there like all day. It was a good time. But that's going to be it for today's vlog. Thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoy and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.